Mm. I have a question for you. When you're walking on the sidewalk and you're about to meet somebody, are you always the one that steps out of the way? When you step out of the way, do you apologize <laughs> for being there? Hmm? Honest question. When you're walking in a room, when you're passing a coworker in in the hallway, are you always stepping out of the way? Are you always moving out of somebody else's path? Are you always sidestepping your right? Why do we do this? Why do we struggle with the ability to take up space, to stand in our own ground, in our own center, and to be deserving of the space that we are in? You are worthy. You don't have to move out of the way for anybody. You are worthy. You are meant to take up space. Take up space. <laughs> But what's preventing us? Why do we do that? Why do we always apologize for who we are, minimize ourselves, make ourselves smaller, and why do we step out of the way when we're not even in the way? Hmm? Well, a couple key things, but ultimately, it's the beliefs. It is our self-belief. It is what we believe about ourselves. Where did that come from? Hmm? Well, Five main influences. This is what I know to be true. Our family, our friends, our society, our education, and our religion. These are the five main influences that created the beliefs that you carry in your life today. And then there were actual experiences as well. Trauma, shame, pain. So we have influence and we have experience. And all of this comes together to create the beliefs that you carry which is the person you become. But when you become aware, you don't have to be that person anymore. You can choose for yourself. You can let that shit go that doesn't serve you. You can take up space. You can own your power as a creator being on this planet, meant to be here, meant to shine, meant to radiate your truth, your light, your purpose, your gifts into the world. You are worthy and we need you. So if you want some assistance on this path, this is my realm. 